talking fewer than no. The soul of a woman was created below. They like the dark side of you. Oh, God. Z. Z, C, B, C, or I'm sorry, K, E, C, Z, and B, F. Telling all of your lies. Let's see what this is. K, C, B, no matches. Stay tuned. Keep coming back. Tell me about this keep coming back. It is here. I keep coming back. What? I don't know what this is to a, this is this is a person. Why do I keep coming back? I know that I should I, I keep coming back because I'm stressed out and I can't stop thinking about somebody. But then when I come back, the communication, I put a guard up with that shit. I don't, I don't, something speechless too. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, male. I keep coming back and to watch you because it's, maybe I think you deserve this King of Pentacles and I don't have it. Like he's secretly planning something, but hold on. Okay, I think he has to be nice to someone right now. He's only given a little bit, but there's something else that's going on where. <clears throat> I'm being pushed, but I have to put my guard up for something because of something else I have going on that's going to help this situation. Yeah. Five of Swords. Mm -hmm. I, he has to act like he doesn't like a certain person or a situation. Yes, he's playing the role he needs to play right now. Stay tuned. Okay. You could be feeling something and it, uh, maybe you feel something every time this, this person is around, but this is your confidence in your self esteem. I think that this man was only confident when he had things. And now, mm, and, but the thing is, the other plan isn't happening because he keeps coming back. That's what it is. And then he takes in this immature, there could be other females he's around that are real jealous of what he wants on the other side. It's like you're taking this, you're constantly allowing this. Swapping spit. You're supposed to be putting up a fence. I think this is a like an invisible fence. Oh, oh, and then there's something here about allowing himself to be fooled or manipulated to now not want that. I'm just letting it happen. Does anybody even know what time it is? You know, he doesn't even realize how long he's been somewhere at a time. Like the, I guess the in-betweens of leaving and coming back. He doesn't even realize how long he's been there at the time. Does anybody, does anybody really care? Uh, Avenger and father. Is this his father? somebody their father is an investigator or an agent or some, has some job like that this could even be a lawyer or I, 
I, there's an opportunity with a house here, though. So that he could sit to himself and look at something differently and have the opportunity to change his perspective on something. There's a father here or some, some man that offered a home or something. Uh, so he thinks that he's stuck fighting with this wife. He doesn't have to be there. Because the more that he stays in this situation, the more he goes back and forth on this path. He already cut the cord with this female. What do I want to get? Time enough to cry. He's not processing any emotion or anything that's going on in this situation at all. And it's because he keeps coming back. I like you even more than all those other objectively better people. Who's he coming back to? I don't think it's the wife. I don't think it is. I think she wishes it was. He doesn't come back to her because there's just always immature bickering back and forth. And yeah, I don't want to be in this marriage. There was something earlier when I flipped cards out about a divorce and somebody not wanting to get a divorce or not facilitating what they're supposed to do, like dragging it on. And I feel like it's the woman. It could be just both laziness or, or this is, it's affecting everything else. Him constantly coming back just to put his guard up or is making there's a project or a project it, it's becoming a project i don't know if that's the terminology that he uses like this is becoming this is a project this is supposed to be easy he doesn't want to be married to this karmic female I think the, the one person that's, it, whatever this is, he keeps coming back to, everybody else is, is his dad's helping in a situation. It could be the mom and the dad help with a situation. If he, I don't know if, if he's drinking or eating something from this female. That could be another reason why. He, if he keeps going back to the female, because th this keep going back thing seems to be, could be a general message that every, someone keeps going back to something that's no good for them. For somebody, it's a home with a wife you don't get along with. But see, this these he sees this as failure. This is I get divorced, then that means I failed. That does that's not what that means. Maybe it's the way he's looking at it. You're supposed to be changing your perspective on it. But that's not failure. It means something wasn't working out. What would be failing is not to end it because it's not getting you anywhere and then constantly have it keep you in this rut. For me, personally, you are exceedingly you. You're the master of your own universe. Are you mastering your universe? Or is your universe mastering you? Had to wear makeup to hide a hickey. This feels like the female. Um, there could have been a situation where he was going to do something or, and he could actually have the hickey. <laughs> you know, you're not black. Cause I don't know. Hickey show up on black men. So you off the hook, hooked up with someone and kept it a secret from my friends. This may not even be a female. 
that gave him this hickey. O or S? A or T? This could be Tamika, Tara, Oscar, or Anton, Anton, E R. All seeing eye. Well, asexual? <laughs> Tell me about this. Oh, divine feminine. Because he's having a hard time, what, dealing? There's a divine feminine here that is the world to this man. One door is not closed, so the other one's not going to open for this divine feminine. And if you think that you can keep that, it, it, there's someone who doesn't want to get the divorce because of what, whatever the reasons are. I don't know if it's that he could have thought he was homeless and here he has another home that was given to him by a father or a grandfather or something. Uh, but because he's not closing out that door, this one with this divine feminine is going to remain shut. And it could be mental torment that someone's ancestors are putting on him. Like we're not going to let you do what this generational curse now is with your bloodline that you're supposed to be breaking of. Just having this, maybe, I don't know, multiple women. Just keeping them hanging. I don't know. Feeling like you need to have all these options open. He could still have really bad addictions right now. And I think that he's he doesn't want to come around you like this. He knows he, he's, yeah. I think what this man, the, the thought process, it's actually the most caring side that he's got. He doesn't want to do this impulsively and then have it get screwed up. He wants to do this right. Yeah, because he, he knows if he does this right now, he may resent you or feel trapped or, he, yeah, because he's going to keep thinking about, I'm married. It sounds like he has a conscience. Great, beautiful. We need more like that. Now, if he has a group of friends or family members where it's like, oh, you actually care. It could be like that. Right? He, don't need, he doesn't even want to say money spells. He doesn't even want to say but the truth about it because he's concerned that someone's going to call him a punk for thinking that way or something. You didn't do anything to deserve this. With the money spells, that shit is going to be going back and promising. Everybody wants to be my enemy until they're in need of a friend. You say he's just a friend. Oh, baby, yeah. <laughs> so he's anticipating what? Oh, Okay. There may be a situation where he doesn't want to get divorced because he was banking on money from this woman's death to do something with another woman. He was also anticipating... Hold on. having something to do with a death and then coming to you with some kind of or or rather than coming to you with some kind of immature manipulative gaslighting I feel like he's waiting on someone to, to die first maybe it's the kind of thing where let's just say there is not okay there's not a, a, a insurance policy for somebody but I'm pretty sure there is it's what everybody's doing but Let's say that someone doesn't have one. It would make them feel better that the wife died. Because at that point, it's not a divorce. It's I didn't fail at marriage. Could you live without the aggravation? You got to run with. There are people who are get so used to chaos and fighting and breaking up and making up that that becomes what they enjoy. And there's those of us who are like, no, thank you. I just can't do it, Captain. What is this? 
responsibility if you take your power back. If, you, if this man just left, because she knows that he's like this. She learned about narcissism or something, and this is what he's in right now when he's doing this. He, uh, if he just said, fuck it, just take whatever. I don't care about the finances. I don't care about the money. The sense of power that that will give this man of saying, I actually did this because it's the only thing to do. I don't love this woman or I don't love her anymore. I know that there's something better for me. Do you realize it's theft? Were they trying to take this house that somebody else left you while you like keeping you Scorpio? Now, now that it's going to cause this tower moment because there's attention drawn to this shit. Now it's going to make it easier. Hold on. They are trying to take the house. So I don't feel like you even owe this this other person an ex, an explanation on I just think it's over. I would ask if is the paperwork even legit? You could have married this person for ulterior motive too. Cause anybody here see the love, see the hate. Feel the emotion. Maybe you're mirroring this guy. And when he's pissed off or agitated, you feel it. Can't hand me down love. Um, he doesn't want to hand me down. Yeah, you're creating your own reality, but you're just you're mixing two. This other one is a distorted lesson learner. I see clearly what the problem has been. The other one is the result of such accountability and acknowledgement. You're trying to combine these two, and, and it's creating this storm. It feels like warm air, cold air. You have warmth on one side. The other shit is cold and dead and just... Pfft. You really want to... You want money off of that? It would be... The money would have something bad attached to it is what it feels like. And he's tired of defending himself or... Me dealing with this shit with the wife is making me like this towards this one. I feel, is, is, are she just like this? <laughs> it's distorting his view of you. See the fuzzy, wuzzy love and cause explosion. Did he change a lot in the past year? That could be when this shit started going real sour. He really thinks that uh, the you divine feminine. Maybe you would for somebody. You are this type of female, and it's horrible that you will only date men if they have things. And I understand that there's a certain. You don't want somebody that's going to constantly take advantage of you, eat the last of your shit, never replace. You don't want a child. But I mean, when you were going through shit and you had nothing, would you have wanted guys to look at you like that? This cord could be cut with this guy just like that. Like, this is how you do it. See ya. Or don't even say that. I don't want to take it because I don't really need it. Just take the shit that you need. Move on. I don't mind all the guys dancing with my girl. He could have been the kind of guy that just really didn't care. He does with someone though. She was going to take off with his friend anyway. When I move, you move just like that. You're not going nowhere. Who 
This is gonna make it easier too. Tell me who's the friend? Tell me the friend E or R. Eric. Freeman? A cop? <laughs> RF. G. Ready for pull. Random forgot. Really funny people. Oh, really fucking pissed. Well, that sounds more like it. That you're happy and content. Even when she's cutting you off. I don't know what happened before, but she would cut off your words. It would get, it would spark, it would get a rise out of you. And I feel like it would give you a tent. You both have narcissistic supply needs. But now it's to the point where I'm glad that you, oh God, I'm so glad that she just cut me off. But then what? The kids are all right. And then, and then he goes to message her though. Yeah, it, it'll, it goes back and forth. It's constant where I'm glad, oh, I'm, I'm glad that she's either blocked me. It feels childish. And then there'll either even be something where she'll say, I'll call the cops because I know this. Blackmail. She can have black nail polish. She knows a cop or an investigator, and she does this to this man all the time. You sneaky, slimy bitch, you. You're a sneaky, slimy broad. I, I can't stand chicks like this. I'll call so-and-so. I have that video or I have that thing where you threatened me or you said you were going to do this. I'll tell you what. The next time that this chick or this person tries to do that shit, something real bad is going to happen. It's going to debilitate them. Got a heart attack, a stroke, death, something. Something. Because this is ridiculous. What is this bullock? Beware of underestimating soft-spoken or mild-mannered individuals. They're overlooked because they're quiet. It's a my life. It's a my life. That's how you have to look at this. This shit is my life. Don't sit there. Don't. Uh, it seems as though I left my life on the bad side of the moon. And that, that keeps him from walking away from this marriage. It's keeping him stuck. With... Ugh. This torment. How about... Tell me what the password is to this person's phone. So he can just... There's a video or something in there. Harrison? Or... Hold on. Clear that. I can't. Harrison. No. Clear that. I can't. Harris. Clear that. I can't remember the tree. Harris, yeah. Clear that. I mean, that's the best I can do here, but this is not a functional relationship. This is dysfunctional. I know you want a functioning relationship or just something that's functional, something that works together with both wheels turning. You have this one wheel wants to turn and the other one is needs to be greased up, maybe. Uh, but, and it's creating... There's, it's lack of movement. Where are we at? 24? Liberator. Go ahead and free yourself. Is that type of... Oh, does he feel like he's going to leave his kids behind? Are they your raised? Are you concerned about who's going to raise your kids? Or maybe you want to take a kid with you and you're like, I don't know. man. Is it? Tell me about the kid real quick. Is that why? 
you don't have to, they're, I don't think the kit is yours because they're saying you don't have to hold on to this. You know this. Use your intuition with this shit. Look, what does this kid look like? I feel like intuitively you know that this could even be your friend's child. What is this? Nice and white satin. Never reaching the end. Letters I've written. Did you write a letter to somebody? There's a P-I here. There's a Piper Gate. P-G, P-I, and, and A-G. That's usually Piper Gates to me, but... Around the world, around the world. Do you live in, a, in another country? First off, I, I see for somebody that this is a mail order bride thing. And there's someone here who did it to make someone jealous because the person that they want to make jealous is beautiful and he couldn't find somebody that could trump that. So he paid for it, I guess, and now he's paying for it. Yeah, no, I... There's, there's no emotion at all. I feel like he can't find any sense of peace in this home. And I think that it's going to get exposed that this person also has a husband and they're con artists and they were con. It just, why? I'm guessing that this started with the guy who wants a different life was a con artist at one point. Or he had ulterior motive for why he got married to women. And, the, and then this is his karma is that she's not even single. She has a husband. They do this conning shit. Bonnie and Clyde. And this is why he's going to have to just cut this shit. And say, fuck it. I don't care about house. I don't care about the bank account. Because this is keeping something else from coming in. I guess we'll see what decision you make. We're not going nowhere. Love you, Filio.